Hey guys, it's Pete Levy, music writer for Milwaukee Journal Sentinel, tapmilwaukee.com. Tonight, John Carpenter played the Path Cedar, the filmmaker, yeah, the guy who made Halloween, who made They Live, who made Assault on Precinct 13, uh, The Thing. Uh, he also did the music for most of the, his films. So tonight, he presented those songs, as well as songs from uh, recent albums, Lost Themes and Lost Themes 2. Uh, it's a different kind of show tonight, uh, and it was one that clearly brought out, you know, die-hard horror fans. During the show, there were a lot of clips from films, and it was really a reminder of how creatively Carpenter killed off people during his filmmaking career. And it really kind of, I think, probably energized the crowd and made them want to kind of go back and see these films. And, and really, you know, arguably Halloween, for instance, wouldn't have been Halloween without that chilling score, which tonight was a little bit a little bit too much kind of rock force to it. Kind of took away a little bit of the, the mystery and the sinisterness of it. Um, that said, uh, you know, Carpenter himself, he was an entertaining performer, uh, which is something that was definitely in question. You know, could a filmmaker be an entertainer on stage, basically performing, not just kind of behind the camera? And he was, you know, he was kind of, you know, you know waving to people with, with smartphones didn't care about that. He was kind of even dancing a jig during uh, Distant Dream, one of his originals uh, from uh, Lost Themes 2. Uh, that said, you know, it was still kind of, you know, even though it pleased a lot of the horror fans it seemed tonight, it was still pretty shallow. Uh, you know, it was a short set, only 75 minutes, and basically he didn't really have any interesting kind of insights or details about his films, no really, really telling stories. Everything was very scripted in between. Um, so it was, you know, a shallow show. That said, it was a different kind of show, and uh, certainly Certainly hit a sweet spot, it seems like, for uh, for Carpenter fans and for horror buffs, uh, considering that this was a kind of a one of a kind sort of event. Uh, for the full review, go to jsonline.com/music, and for more concert happening, check out my newsletter, Piet Levy's Music Picks. Subscribe to jsonline.com/newsletters. Thanks.